that what? concert that? Well, uh, well, that's Sam. Do you want to kill some time? I thought I already did. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, let's, let's grab that bag over right. here and. Uh, what bag? Oh, all right. Well, let's talk about that concert. Yeah, just give me that bag real quick. Give me that <clears> thing <throat> here. This is the concert that Mike uh, Michael Stuck doesn't want me to talk about. Well, I don't want. Here you go, Jim. Let's, Thank let's, you, Mike. Uh, oh, jeez. Oh, oh. It's a sort of a touchy subject, but um, you know, I think it's this is an issue we should address. We haven't really talked about women's music per se, and a lot of our listeners out there probably don't know what women's music is. And I was sort of ignorant about it, <laughs> although I've been to a few women's music concerts without really knowing that they were quote women's music. So I went to see Sweet Honey in the Rock, a great acapella acapella uh, uh, group that sings uh, all kinds of different things. And, uh, so what is women's music, Alan? Well, you're, you're, you're Mr. Folk, Mr. Stock, aren't you going to tell <laughs> me? that you can explain it. But uh, I, I have some albums here, or rather you brought in some albums. It's funny, you didn't want me to talk about the, the concert, but yet you brought in these albums. To, well, that's because you requested them, Mr. Yeah, Poe. Yeah. Well, what we did, we went to a Washington Sisters concert, which is sort of like, they're sort of like uh, um, Sweet Honey and the Rock, except there's only two of them. It was a great concert. Great concert. Great Excellent concert. music. And I, I have this album myself, as does Mr. Folk. This is his. Um, but uh, they're, it's great stuff. And, you know, I went to the concert without really knowing much about them, except that I like the album. But lo and behold, Mr. Stock and I, we get there, we're the only men in the whole place, anywhere. I mean, within a whole, you know, like a two mile radius of uh, the Miami Way Theater is where it was. And, and it was uh, an incident. I didn't expect to be the only man at the concert, but well, you it, it was there a. Too. But uh, like I say, I was the. Uh, it, was, it was an interesting experience being the only men at this concert, and yeah. and our friend Mark Weiser was there. Our too. friend Mark Weiser yeah. was there, and so I, I it was it was a good concert. It but was great. I, it was it was refreshing to see a concert yeah. like this in Miami, where where all women attended. Yeah, and and Mark and I, we like to go right. When we go to concerts, we like to get right down close to the. Uh, uh, performers so we can see facial expressions and eyes and all that and so we went right down front and at, at intermission Michael Stock Mr. Sensitive a snag and that what you are a sensitive, a sensitive new, age, new guy. age guy he felt like we were separating the women on stage from the women in the audience and we shouldn't be sitting in the front so we had to go move into the back and that got a little more embarrassing because you see these women these, at these women concerts are all of uh, should we say uh, Sexually, am sexually ambiguous? Le lesbian women lesbian. who attended these shows. Yeah, and you should explain that they don't like that, that just lesbian is a preferred. Well, they prefer lesbian. Yeah. That's what they. That's what they are. They're yeah. lesbians. Yeah. And they and they attended this concert, and that's they, it was it was for them. So and I I being like the only men there was a little bit uncomfortable. I felt like being in the back that we were like spying on them. So Mark and I, we moved back right up front so we wouldn't be so they could do whatever they wanted behind us and we wouldn't okay, be privy so, to it. Okay, so Alan, why did you bring this up? Why did you have to mention this? Because we had to kill time. So here's <laughs> Holly Near. This is the most popular of uh, of the women's music movement, right? She's the like she the, was she's the most the, popular. Yeah, she was one of the forerunners of, of women's music. Yeah. Yes. And here we have uh, Frank. Wait, Mr. Stock. I thought you were going to bring in just women's music here. This is, this is a woman. This oh. is a woman named Frank. Oh, this is a woman and this is more or less a public service because oh. it's important is that, that the audience huh? knows that this, this yeah. music is Here's available. Picture of her. Oops. Okay, okay Frank. Well, 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 Mr. Al Alan, we finished with Wendy this Carlos. Carlos. Mm -hmm. Wendy, Wendy Carlos. Is that, is that women's music? Wendy, Wendy Carlos. Carlos. Walter Carlos. Walter Carlos. He had a, he had a sex change. That's he had a sex change. And so does that make him women's music? Just get a sex change. Are we finished yet, Alan Poe? Well, we'll do this real fast. This woman I've never heard of, so he won't talk about her. And Williams. Get the sex change, Mike. Crips Williamson. Now, this one I've heard of. And I'd like to point out that it says this album was produced with the help of the following women. Almost all of these albums, all the technicians, all the sound people, uh, they're all women. All There's women. no men on the album anywhere. Oh, that's changing they recently. Don't. That's changing in recent mm -hmm. times. And here's a couple of girls that are kind of funny looking. They look, uh, no, those are two the, guys. Those are two guys. This is a gay album. Like, gay the, album. like the lesbian albums, these are gay albums. Gay and these album. are just so people who are interested you in these type in of music. Me, like, they are, there are support groups. There give are me a music homosexual, a sodomy song. What kind of stuff? What kind of self-respecting faggot am I? I don't, I don't even like to say that's that word name, on TV. That's the name of the song, Alan. Let's, I let's heard that get going. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Okay. All right, so we were going to ask you to play a song before Alan Poe here interrupted us. I was asked us. to kill time. I did it. Let's go. Okay. You ready? <laughs> right. Want some water? Are no, you okay? You a little no, bit of water I'm here? I'm fine. You're Thanks. Uh, right. this, is, this, is a, <laughs> this is a different kind of song. It's got like a lot of uh, audio humor, I guess I'd have to call it, if I was going to call it. Oh, darling. 
darling, please come home, I'm lonely You've been gone almost all night I want to throw my arms around you And hold, hold you tight I want to take you to my heart But it's you I'm thinking of darling, please come home, I'm lonely I'm lonely for your love Oh, darling, please come home, I'm lonely You've been gone almost all night I want to throw my arms around you And hold, hold you tight I want to take you to my heart But it's you I'm thinking of oh, darling, please come home, I'm lonely I'm lonely for your love I'm waiting for the sight of the headlights I'm Come into view And I'm standing looking out of my window Darling, and no one else will do I want to take you to my heart But it's you I'm thinking of Darling, please come home, I'm lonely I'm lonely for your love Oh, darling, please come home, I'm lonely I'm lonely for your love Oh, darling Usually that that thing that people get by banging their their guitar, That's don't they? Doing. Did you hear that? Oh no, it does. I fooled you. <laughs> You're a ventriloquist, right? It was really you hitting the guitar, but it, it making it sound like it mouth. came out of your That's mouth. Right. I was doing my voice before and fooled you. Out. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> All right, Sam, do you have any last jokes? Well, I was in the Grove last week, the trendiest place in America, and it's the only place in the world where the homeless read Architectural Digest. Now you want last joke? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. You guys slaying me, man. Woo! No more. No more. <laughs> it's a tough road. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, is he out of time? Are we out of time? <laughs> How much time do we have left? <laughs> well, oh, it's an hour today. It's an hour today. Yeah. I think Let's that talk does more it. about that concert. No, no, no. <laughs> I think that does it, Alan. I think we could say goodbye and, and be thankful that it's time to leave. This has been New Traditions, and we're here every week. Same channel, same station, same time, and same people, Alan Poe and myself. Yeah. And uh, stand in those t-shirts, folks. Ready for our closing theme? I, I guess I am, Mr. Stack. Okay. You Actually, Jim, you want to play a closer here? All right. Just go ahead. Just play anything you want. Inside my heart does dwell A wishing well, a wishing well And I wonder if your heart can tell That in this world I wish you well Deep inside the wishing well kind of heart does dwell and I know that magic heart can tell that in this world 